Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to be a part of a collab. It's Hippie Manicures, Make Love, Not War. And here is a picture of all the participants. I will have links down below for everyone to follow. I started my manicure off with Miracle Nail Fix and Simple Colors, Snow Me White. And I topped that off with Pure Ice Girl on the run so it would dry real quick. And I'm using this on my Cindy hand. I switched to the liquid latex on my other hand. And I'll be water marbling with these polishes from Pipe Dream Polish. I will have all the names listed down below. This collection is no longer available, but I wanted to use them because they were really hippy trippy colors. Very bright neons. And like I said, I've changed over to the liquid latex that I normally use on my other hand. And I'm going to start building my bullseye by dropping a drop of each polish in. And as you saw, I ran the toothpick around my edge to make it spread out real good. There we go. Now you can see a little better. But I'm going to do a full round of all of them and then probably a drop or two of the first two or three. Well, it looks like I'm just going to keep on going. They're spreading so nicely, let's just keep rolling with it. Got a very nice bullseye going on here, guys and girls. I'm going to start drawing in my design with a toothpick. I'm just going from the outer edge to the center and dipping down. Kind of anchor those, those lines that I'm drawing. And I'm doing a petal design today. I'm going to just keep going because these are playing so nicely in the water. That's pretty gravy looking right there. <laughs> and I picked out a spot I liked and I dipped my thumb down in it. And now I'm going to get that excess polish off of the top of the water. And I just used the toothpick. But you want to get all of that off there because you don't want that messing up your design. And looky there. Hippy trippy. And I'm taking this toothbrush, tooth, toothbrush, toothpick around the edge of my fingernail to kind of bust that seal. And use my tweezers, I'm going to go ahead and remove this latex before the paint gets real dry. And there we go. Thumbs done. And I've done that to all of my fingers. And I'm going to go ahead and add some quick dry top coat to this. And I'm using the Pure Ice Girl on the Run again, making sure to cap those edges. And you can see how the colors just pop after you start putting that top coat on. It's just beautiful. I love it. And this would be hippy trippy enough, but I can't leave it alone. I've got to do some stamping. I'm using this um, Bundle Monster Plate number 304, and I'm going to use the Happy Smiley Faces. And off to the side, I've got my Queen Scraper and my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper. Today, I'm just stamping with black and white polishes from Born Pretty. And this one, I'm just popping it on just like it is. All those little smiley faces. And now I'm going to change to um, another plate. And it's also from Bundle Monster. And it's the Bundle Monster 09. And I'm going to stamp this love in white. To kind of give me a base. And then I'm going to stamp over it with some black to make it show up better. I use the white to make the, the black letters pop. And while I've got a second, I would really like to thank Chris and Mary both for hosting this collab. This is just really fun. I'm going to move on now to another Bundle Monster plate. And this is Bundle Monster 320. I'm going to be using that peace sign design in the center. And I'm going to do it just like I did the other one. I'm going to put the white down first and then stamp over it with black. I just figured those neon colors might make it hard to see my stamping. Here 
here we go. Let's see how this one looks. Very nice. All right, we got two more fingers to go. I'm moving on to Bundle Monster 412. And I'm gonna use this other love that's got the little heart in it. I didn't like that image. We're gonna we're gonna do a do-over. Sometimes that happens with stamping. Well, we're gonna have to do another do-over. <laughs> It didn't like how I was scraping. Yay, we got it. I'm going to try to get that centered on there as best I can. And before I forget, there's a whole lot of people involved in this collab. It's on Instagram and YouTube. There's going to be a link down in the description box for um, all of the people that are involved in this so that you can go check everyone's videos and pictures out. And I've got to fix this little heart. It's just wearing me out. So I'm just going to pull up just the heart. Well, I'm going to try to pull up the heart. I'm going to get this heart picked up. There we go. And this is how I'm going to fix this one. There we go. Awesome. We're going to go back to this other plate, the one that had the love on it. I've already used this, and I'm going to use this little heart on my pinky nail. And it fits so nicely. And I know this looks like a lot of steps, but it really went pretty quick. go. Everything's all stamped up. And I've cleaned up and I'm going to top this manicure off with some posh top coat. My camera is freaking out over these neons. I apologize. It's like, whoa! <laughs> I do have a still photo at the end so you'll be able to see it without me moving or the camera blurring. capping those ends because I want this mani to last. I'm going to break out my orange wood stick and do a little bit of cleanup. There we go. And that is my manicure. My hippie manicure. And I did do both hands. <laughs> my poor Sandy hand. Bless her heart. And there's my final photo. I hope you guys like this one. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Be sure to check out everybody else's videos. And until next time, be good to yourself. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye.